I'm Jake with Senkut Sen, and today we're talking about gauge thickness versus the actual physical measurement. Before we had a way to describe physical measurements, we used gauge charts to describe the thickness of the material. The problem with this is, is that different materials use different gauge charts, and that's because it's dependent on the density of the material to describe the thickness. Typically, gauge charts go from a gauge of 3 to 30, and as that number goes up, the material thicknesses actually goes down. And since we're using different gauge charts, you can make the mistake of ordering the wrong thickness of material. Steel uses a steel gauge chart, while aluminum you use an aluminum gauge chart. Let's look at an example of that. If you were to order 10 gauge steel, you're gonna get a physical measurement of 135 thousandths of an inch. Whereas if you order 10 gauge aluminum, you're gonna get a physical measurement of 102 thousandths of an inch. That's a 30 thousandths difference. So if you use the wrong gauge chart, it's more than enough to mess up your design. To protect your design and ordering the wrong material, we made it easy for you though. If you go to our website, and you select the material, you're gonna see all of the physical measurements that we have for that material in both imperial and metric system. If you have any questions regarding the thickness of the material that you're ordering or anything else about your design, please don't hesitate to reach out to us at support at Thanks for watching, stay tuned for more.